What's up YouTube, how you doing? This is Mr. Tyrebox123 and in this video I'm going to be bringing you some coverage of the touch to share feature of stroke functionality on the HP touchpad and also the HP Pre3 phone running webOS. So the idea really behind the touch to share feature is that if you're working on your phone and you come in and you want to switch over to your touchpad it's a very simple transition to do so or if you're indoors you're sitting on the sofa and you've got some web pages open on your touchpad you can simply pass them over very simply to your phone, go outside and carry on exactly as you were. You can also use it for phone calls and also for text messaging. So anyway, let's start off with a web page. So I'll just open up a web page here on my Pre3. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to simply pick that up and place it on the sensor of the touchpad. And now the touchpad should launch a web page without me touching it and open it to exactly the same point that we're at now. And there we go, so it's opened up the uh, Facebook login page in exactly the same on both of them. Now if we just clear that off, and do the same on this one, it actually opened two there by accident. And then what we can do here, is we can now open a web page on the touchpad to do it in the reverse order. We'll just open up Google. And now what I can do is I can just simply place the Palm Pre 3 down onto the touchpad. Now that should do it in the reverse direction. Whoops, I, I picked it up by accident there. Now that should do it in the reverse direction. So we can see now on the pre free, it's actually opened up the same web page so it works in both directions. Just clear that off. Now, one of the coolest things about this is the ability to make and receive phone calls from either device. So if I've got next to me now my phone. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to make a phone call to the pre three, bearing in mind there's no GSM chip in this whatsoever and then we're going to see the phone call come up on both devices, hopefully. So we can see the phone calls come in on the phone, and we can also see the phone calls come in on the HP touchpad as well. So if I answer that on the touchpad, and now I talk into the phone, you can hear the voice coming out of the loudspeaker of the touchpad. Now what we can do as well, is we can actually transfer the audio by simply pressing audio here, and we can then just transfer the phone call back to the actual phone itself. And then we can simply end that phone call. So an absolutely fantastic piece of functionality there. Now the second part to this is the ability to send and receive text messages between the two. Now I've got to try and cover up my phone number whilst I'm doing this. So I'm just going to send a text message to my pre-free phone. In fact, if we just close, well, in fact, we'll leave them open, see what happens. So I've now sent that text message, which should come up on my phone. And actually, with the touch to share feature, should also come up on my touchpad as well. So you can see here, at the bottom, it says Adam Matthews test, where the text message is coming from me. And at the top there, it also came in and told us that we had a text message as well. Now, if I actually click on that, sorry, but it did reveal the number, so I can't show you that. but. The idea is, is that you can send and receive text messages completely between the two. You can actually go into the messaging application on the, on the touchpad, send a text message, it goes via the phone and sends it out to the recipient as well. So anyway guys, there's the touch to share functionality. I think it's absolutely mind blowing technology. I really wish that all of the other vendors who are doing these kind of phones, stroke tablets, obviously everyone knows who I mean, would start doing something fairly similar to this because it's actually the most exciting bit of technology I've seen on a tablet and a phone in a long time. Anyway guys, thanks very much for watching. Leave your comments below. If you like this video, subscribe for more and I'll see you all in the next one. See ya.